Happy Friday. Motives. What are, what's the why of it? Why, what are my motives behind what I'm doing? Anything I'm doing. Um, is it instinctual? Are the instincts going awry? Um, selfish and self-centered? Are they altruistic? Like, I don't know. With, with, those are questions that I ask myself more in my in the last few years of my life than than when I was younger. Because when I was younger, I was way more selfish, <laughs> way more selfish and self-centered, and um, and you know maybe that's a uh, for me that was the result of my youth. But you know, luckily, uh, I uh, I woke up a little bit. Um, but I think what's interesting about, I don't know, humans, and maybe every human, I don't know about this particular human, me, is that if I don't continue to keep asking the, that question within my daily life, my selfish and self-centered part will begin to try to find its way in and steer me back to maybe taking care of myself more than anything. And... Um, Maybe that's born of fear, born of whatever, you know, fear of loss, fear of not being recognized, fear of um, not having enough, you know, not being enough. Any of those fears, which are, again, for, for, for me, for this individual, may have been more instinctual as I was growing up. Maybe I didn't get enough attention. I didn't get enough pats on the head for my dad. Um, who knows? Um, what I can do is look at my motives and my actions today and what I do. And, you know, and then find a community, which I think is essential because I don't, I can't particularly, I can't live in a vacuum. If I, if I am the only one counseling me on my life and my motives and my, I will be a crazy person. And that's where I think community and family is essential. People to depend on and lean on and be sounding boards. And uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know. Friday babble. Well, you know, that's what I'm thinking about. And I haven't even had coffee yet. So much love.